<laughs> I'll be in shortly. I'm so tired, yeah. We're about to upload our, our video. What will she try to strike Jessica Messica for reacting to her? The hypocrisy is shocking. Are you serious? No, you've got to be joking. Hi, PNV. Well, actually, on the topic of hypocrites. Hi, Big Toe, Breezeth. Hello. I'm so happy that you guys are here. Why is somebody, like, literally, do you guys not remember when I, let's speak about hip hypocrites. First of all, the obvious, my thumbnail. Have you seen, did you not see when I first came to Kuwait, this hideous beast said, oh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna co cover her in Kuwait. It, it's too boring. Literally, every single thing I upload, she covers. So again, where's your, where's your hiatus on my content? Just like booze in, just like everybody. My Kuwait arc is boring, yet every single person uses it every single day for hours. So how is it boring? Flop era, shut the fuck up. Go away. Bye, you're blocked. So I don't want any of her freaking supporters in here. I don't care. She's just a liar. Like, oh, her Kuwait arc is boring. I'm never going to cover her. What else do you have to do? Seriously, you literally talk about me posting a picture of my uh, hamster in the air fryer as a joke. You literally are talking about me eating pizza when your chins are like 500 times bigger than mine. Seriously, look at the friggin' prof look at my, my uh, profile pic, or profile pic, what do you call it? Thumbnail. Look at the thumbnail. Seriously. How many, like, how many pizzas do you eat in secret? There's a reason you're not showing yourself on camera. Because you are disgusted with how you look, you hate being fat, so you take it out on everyone else. Upload a date vlog challenge, seriously. <coughs> she has to do at this point, you are the most money content-wise. No, BBJ is the most money content-wise right now. She's literally torturing a cat, claiming it's in... You take a picture of her, anyone can do that. Doesn't mean the cat's not suffering. Oh, she's do, she's on the mend, really? Let's see proof of it. Let's see an effing video of her. Let's see, like, guarantee that cat is suffering. If it has severe arthritis and so many other things, she's disgusting. First of all, how she attained the cat makes her a piece of shit, number one, to begin with. And then to go and milk it for views and everything else makes her a bigger piece of crap. But whatever, I'm not even talking about that anymore. <laughs> You can call me an animal abuser all you want. I don't care. I've already said that. Um, it's all the same morons who do it anyways. The point is, I'm here to laugh in her fat, ugly face, her 800 chins, that she has to use me for content. Have you seen her video of the guy that she lusts over? 5,000 views. Another thing, and I saw a really good point about this, like this biatch is harping on me for my cat care. Are you kidding? You hang out and get high and then drive home high, by the way. You get high with the biggest lowlife, Shannon, who literally locks her dogs. When I, the last time I went to Shannon's house, she locked her dog because she can't control it. So when she can't control her dog because she doesn't even bother to get it trained or whatever, doesn't take care of it, she locks it in a bedroom. The whole time I was there, it was squealing to come out, pawing at the door. She was yelling at it. Bah! She lets, she didn't take her dog to the vets on time. So where's the outrage for her? Where's the outrage for her? <clears throat> she was smoking on camera and then drove home. So she was smoking on camera. So I don't want to hear anyone come for me for driving high when I never did. Where's, oh, did I do that? Like, seriously. <sighs> Shut up. People are so, so, so self-righteous when they have no right to be. That's what I'm mad about. I should literally take a hiatus from YouTube for, like, a month. Totally should do it. I don't want to, like, why should I punish, like, my Beezers for that? You know what I mean? So she sits there behind the camera and fat shames me. When I look, uh, even if I was 100 pounds loser, I would be better looking than you. Like, the proof is I have a hot husband and you have to make one up. You have to make one up and go hang out with Shannon on Valentine's Day. You are a loser. So have fun with BBJ that you're milking for views and abusing the cat even more by putting her through hell just so you can look like an effing hero when you're a big hypocrite because you need to keep that same energy, French fried chins, with your friend Shannon, who you do drugs with. And obviously she was on camera. You both coke up and then drive back to Montreal, NDG. You freaking ghetto piece of crap loser. Thank you. And tell her to take care of her dog. She let her dog go with rabies and bit people for a whole month and didn't take her to the vet. <laughs> Missy, you need to shut your self-righteous trap. You're a clout chaser at this point. Do you not, how do you go from comparing Breezy Boozin to Casey Anthony just a month ago? You literally called her a child, compared her to a child murderer. And now you're gonna, con you're gonna, you're gonna defend her because I said something about her. You're just like all of the other morons who do the same thing. Sarah Blaine, you're just like her. You're just like her when just a month ago, you were just complaining about all of these people. In the DMs, your husband himself said many times to Salah, oh, Missy would never ever talk about Chantal, even if something happened. And here you are hoping to get like, what? Hoping to get like views like FFG has based on my name again? You had like 17 people in your stupid chat. Nobody likes to listen to you talk. Nobody cares including me and the, like <laughs>
I don't ever want to hear any of your self-righteous crap. And you, Goblin, I don't want to ever hear you say, oh, her content's boring because it's paying your bills and those vet bills that you're milking for views. Thank you. You're welcome. She is a goblin. She looks like a goblin. Look at the pic. She looks like an old man with no teeth. And yeah, I'm probably going to hell for saying that. I don't care at this point. Like, seriously. Whatever. Self-defense. And pizza. The pizza I'm eating. Blah, blah, blah. Talking crap about my husband. When she's like 900 pounds herself. We can clearly see this from the thumbnail. So you're clearly scarfing down something behind the scenes. You're not eating arugula salads. For those of you who don't know, I'm living permanently here now. We're not going to Canada. So again, you're wrong about that. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. I love it. I love it. You're wrong wrong about him using me for citizenship you're wrong about everything that you have like that you talk about there's no point no sarah's just a like they're both the, her and her panel are a bunch of demented weird projecting bored middle-aged women who have no life literally have nothing going on in their life i don't know what their problem is i'm not i'm i'm not the one who wait till you see our vlog today how nice our day was like literally go live your life go live your life take care of your pets they look mangy they look weird Ugh. And she treats them like her kids. I, I don't feel that way anymore about animals. Honestly, I, I love animals. Um, I loved my cats. You're never going to take that away from me. I don't care what you say. I don't care how you try to damage my reputation. I'll never go anywhere and I'll always have some people supporting me. And even if I don't, whatever, you're not going to get rid of me that easy. So anyway, yeah, what she, she, number one, you film from a potato. You film in the wrong rotation and you film your laptop trying to what? trying to say that she was trying to say that uh, something's fishy about Salah and all these men are adding her on on Instagram whatever you're a fat white woman with friggin uh, Canadian citizenship maybe somebody wanted you for that I don't know I'm getting so much hate over Harry Harry's cage I swear like I, I just ignore like whatever I don't even care <laughs> it's so ridiculous this this hamster would be cat food if it weren't for living in this apartment he's lucky to be here okay he was in a cage when we bought him with a hundred million other hamsters didn't look like he had a good quality of life okay so we took him from that gave him his own place with a wheel with tunnels with a whole bunch of bedding he can borrow in the wood shavings I give him fresh salad every day I give him mango I give him food he has fresh water he has a playpen so can it Keep your outrage up your butt because it's not, I don't care. Just getting that out there. Why, like seriously, why am I being fat shamed? By honestly, all of the reactors have FUPAs and are about 900 pounds each. No, okay, sorry. If you collect all their weight together, please give me a break. I'm sorry. Like you literally are fat people fat shaming another fat person. If that's not projection 101, I don't know what is. Chantal Goblin is an anti-Semitic. Please stop using it. What? <laughs> like I have no problem with how I look. My husband has no problem. At least I don't look like a toothless old man who got stung by a bunch of bees. Yes, you're right. You nailed it. <laughs> you nailed it, Colonel. So you're telling me all those people. So basically, but when they say things about me, they're talking about themselves. Because if you're saying that no man will touch me, whatever, you're fat, you look like this, you look like that. Sarah, like Sarah Jane has the nerve to call me Jabba the Hutt for laying down. Have you seen your screen capture of you laying in bed? Oh my God, Rhonda. Shannon and FFG, they belong together. They're both white trash. Thank you, Breeze. <laughs> Yeah, I have no filters. This is like not filtered. Honestly, I kind of like how I look better without filters. It's my natural face. Why would I not like it? It's a face God gave me, you know? I've seen a video from somebody who's trying so hard to just make me look bad among many people. So it's like they took my TikTok and put my, my face with no makeup on and I still looked nice. So what are you proving? So, oh, what's the matter? You don't like that I talk out against these people who talk about me every day? Stay mad. Violin for you. Get out of here. Keep your crappy dollar. She's the animal abuser. Exactly. She's f just prolonging. Like, you know what I mean? I'm so sick of the subject. Like, I'm so sick of, like, people telling people how to take care of their pets. Like, F off. It's, I, I don't care. You're not going to get to me for it. I don't care if you think I'm an animal abuser. I don't care if you cancel me. I don't care. I never will. That, like, I, I honestly don't even want to be part of this platform anymore. It's ridiculous that, like, I put out content and then, like, at least seven people a day or more go live for hours dissecting and talking about every stupid, ridiculous thing that they're worse guilty of or they're even worse, like in weight and whatever. It's just so dumb. I, I like, it makes me hate people. Yeah. And I'm the vile person. I'm the vile person because my cat's nails were overgrown. Like, give me a break. My one cat's nails because she was older. Like, I don't know what people want. Do you want me to cut off my arm? Will that make it better for you? You literally value, like you don't value human life at all. You people are ridiculous. I like people who are just d disgusting, disgusting, hateful people ridiculous and then this moron with a friggin orange creamsicle hair hairdo like 25 years old has no life experience obviously has the nerve to say she never got drunk and then judge me for what happened when i got drunk like get a life you can't judge something you don't know have you ever been in an abusive relationship no 
Number one, I don't give a shit what you think. Number two, are you kidding? You can, do you know how many people you scroll through on TikTok? There's literal women half naked on there. You showed your, you barely, almost showed your boobs on your TikTok. Are you kidding? We should be more worried about you, you weirdo. <laughs> oh my God, I can't with people. whatever and i'm not unhappy i'm the happiest i've ever been in a long time like just because i speak out about like people being hypocrites and i'm not happy with being abused on a platform um over and over again that i'm unhappy yeah because of you guys not because of my personal life i can't believe i've been ranting for an hour content <laughs> i don't even like other than these little rants i don't ever talk about people like in my videos like we're about to upload a vlog of us having a wonderful day can she say the same no all she's doing is oh what can i milk for bbj now like that's her life you know so you can shove it. I don't care. I'm not going to be accountable to you. I don't care. Stay mad. That's my motto. Stay mad. Do you guys want stay mad merch? Honestly, if people, if you make people mad, you're doing something right, I guess. Ruin the suit. Totally fine. Oh, oh, I smoked weed a couple times around them. I don't chain smoke red cigarettes in front of my cats, okay? Seriously. Get a life. Anyway, here I am with no filters, still cute, and I don't even have hardly any makeup on. So damn cute. Come on. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, she doesn't even have a neck. It's like down here, her gullet. Yeah. She has a gullet. She's disgusting. Gullet. So maybe I have chins, but you have a gullet. So which one's better? So she can have her hate money. I don't care. She can have her hate views. I don't care. At the end of the day, she doesn't have him. She doesn't have a life at all, period, beyond obsessing over mine and my leftovers. So, you know. Just guys, all uh, pray for the two dogs uh, killed by FFG. <laughs> pray. Seriously. Yeah, rest in peace. I don't know. I heard a rumor like she killed her second dog. <laughs> For like, because it would had like separation anxiety from the first dog that died. Okay, if it's if it's right to uh, to uh, to kill the dog by vet, it's okay. But why she come for you? Yeah, exactly. And talk about you and call you animal abuser. Okay. What does that mean? Good night. Oh, good night. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you later. See good you. Good night, guys. Bye.